Alrighty, let's watch it in full first. <laughs> nice. That's cool, I like it. Let me just see what this is, okay. All right, I think that's okay in terms of the cut. I almost wish it was a bit further away. He's not hugely different in size. I like that there's definitely a set change. Whoa, I'm still on arrow mode here. <laughs> uh, a change in set. But it's almost like a pop. So if you can have something where, you know, whatever background you have could be, I almost see this as like higher up in the mountains. You know, he could have some landscapey things, some mountains there, nothing crazy. But then when it cuts to this, the mountain might finish. And then you have, you know, like trees or something. So there's just a very clear change visually. And then I would zoom out a little bit. Because then it will also give you the opportunity to have that more in frame. So imagine, you know, it might be this small. And then you can continue whatever, wherever you have your arm here with your back. And in the frame, it could be maybe, maybe even all the way up to here. That would be my first comment. It's not huge. I think that would be, you know, it can easily be fixed even once you're done. So that is for that. This, what I'm concerned about is that this is still fairly high in terms of where he appears from, right? So it would have to be somewhere fairly higher. And he comes down straight into this and then goes over this way where to me, it seems like you're gonna have to have him really really squat this way even potentially putting down down his hand just the compression to me seems not enough Doom. yeah it's too easy to go over this way that's cool i like that i like that as you spline this i would definitely try to have maybe even more profile really push and sell that moment of I am still looking to the left and then I wouldn't go too far yet it feels a bit small foot wise so I will, I will what I'm saying is not go too far with the rotation so that the foot is still like that you have a better idea of the structure this gets very tiny even if it's just a little bit it'll be nicer gets into this into that that's fine I love that just play this timing wise the step i mean you know you're gonna have, you have massive work ahead in terms of something like that like there's so many huge changes over one frame so we'll see how the actual timing will be i think that could be faster more of a jump up into that currently in step i think this is too slow and this too this feels slow. Especially with something, if you're going like this and you're leaning so far off balance to then take a step, and this is the foot here, like this foot is here now. So it's it's gonna slip there. And this guy is here. Like it feels like he would be, he would be here. And then even this, it, there's momentum. So even after that, he would be, to me, jumping off this way. But then it's here. So that sudden move doesn't go anywhere by jumping straight up there. So we might have to extend this. But still, that, see, that will be the tricky thing. I mean, you're going to have to have some potential traveling with the camera or panning. I mean, this whole thing could also be done in one shot potentially just throwing that out there but yeah timing wise it felt like that's just kind of odd a bit slow and even that the arc in the drop just a bit 
It's good to have hang time here. But yeah, four momentum and it's a bit a bit like ten percent faster. But that's kind of that. I like the idea a lot. It's gonna be some fun stuff there. And I'm assuming this is a window, so I would put in some transparency, and then you can see the continuation of a room, maybe a table with a pot, something that you know. Unless this is like a solid wall, they didn't get it. But it would be kind of funny if it was glass and fairly transparent. And then you can see the rest in here. Anyway, just throwing out some ideas. But that is that. It's cool stuff. Thanks. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.